Locals jokingly call it the Dubai of Afghanistan. But while it's true that the western city of Herat enjoys better security and infrastructure than other parts of the country, the local economy still needs improvement. The challenge that we face in Herat province, unfortunately, is the poor economical condition for women. We have lots of women who lost their husbands because of three decades of war, women who are victims of violence or who don't have physical freedom. And through centres like these, we can tackle some of these problems up to a point. The inauguration of Herat's first women's centre, built with the help of the Italian Provincial Reconstruction Team, hopes to provide business lessons, education and a marketplace for traditional handicrafts. It will also provide support for widows and victims of domestic violence. The importance of supporting women stems from the fact that they are fundamental in civil society, providing independent activity for them so they can have a better life for their families strengthens their role. In turn, this effort to stabilize the family unit contributes to creating a modern society, the final goal being to have better life conditions, eradicate poverty and all the potential factors that drive Afghans to join the insurgency and terrorism. But the center faces challenges even before it opens. The day-to-day -day managers will have to convince husbands, fathers and brothers that it's a safe place for women, as well as encouraging the continuing support of local power brokers in a traditionally conservative area. Without this, the building could continue to stand empty. Because of security, because of cultural barriers, because of traditional practices, because of the, um, the limitation of women access to this type of centers always um, kept empty and for a long time and then after that it's closed down. In terms of women's rights, it's more conservative, it's more backward. Um, the freedom that women today enjoying in the capital, it is not the same that we do in Herat. In a country full of widows and little money to go around for extended families, it's crucial that women can make the most of their earning potential. Until now, they had to rely on male relatives to take their goods to local markets, often losing money through middlemen. Providing them with a marketplace where they can take the whole of the profit is a start, but it's the business and computer classes they'll take here that will really give them a sustainable future. You know, women are part of the society. We are half of the population, you know, we should not be ignored. Um, and I believe and I always convince them that no country can truly prosper without the participation of its female populations. This is Ruth Owen in Herat for the NATO Channel.